hi welcome on neuropedia education platform and uh, this particular video is related to those students who are looking for opportunities in uh, uh, you know higher education courses without gate those who do not have gate score and they want to pursue mtech program uh, in the self finance category for them uh, you know there are so many iits which uh, have already now release their forms and you have already filled i mean yesterday was iit hyderabad last date self finance in which you can apply for mtech courses without gate score but you have to pay more similarly jodhpur was also there and couple of more iits were there there are private institutes also which uh, you can join and uh, what about nits yes uh, yeah triple it is bangalore triple it hyderabad we have already covered and now let me talk about nit yes there are some nits which provide you self finance but uh, you know uh, nits uh, may self finance means sometime they allow you without gate but then they want some kind of no objection certificate from the employer with which you are employed so you need to see that very carefully like uh, if you are already working somewhere and then uh, you do not have gate score then they uh, allow you to come for interview and written exam and then you can pursue your mtech but without job or without uh, sponsorship from some uh, you know employer or no objection certificate for, of uh, employer you may not attend it so there are a couple of nits and we will upload that uh, detail uh, as and when it comes uh, yesterday uh, i nit warangal has come out with the, its form but that is you know, self finance form but then they are asking for no objection certificate let me share that information with you so i take you first uh, uh, to uh, you know this uh, self finance uh, course of uh, nit warangal uh, what i am talking about that is the self finance uh, mtech program so if you go into this they will permit uh, for self finance mtech in couple of departments you know there are eight departments different courses so yesterday only they announced you know the applications for that uh, last date is 24th may uh, we will provide you more details about that as of now you people are busy with your other applications so you have the time you can give some more time for this but my question my point is like you see the entire application carefully before you apply so uh, this eligibility criteria what is the cgpa requirement you know normally nit is ask for 60% and uh, you have to go for written test and interview wherever there is a self finance there is a written exam uh, test and interview there is a eligibility and then you know they will talk about the fee structure that also you should see later on in the next part the fee structure and all but uh, other details like uh, how to apply that is uh, something which is important for you now this is what i wanted you to understand like when you go to uh, application uh, category of full time basis then uh, you are supposed to uh, pay fees of 1600 rupees to apply for this and there is a link also they have provided you can do that candidate who are employed and wish to do mtech on self finance basis under full time must enclose no objection certificate from the employer so uh, this is for those who are employed and do mtech on self finance basis under full time so those who are employed they should give no objection certificate from the employer that is also the condition so it is not that you should be employed this is not the condition for that you should very carefully see that but some nits may self finance means uh, industrially finance that also is the point you should be very very careful now the probability of those candidates who are self employed the probability of those candidates who are employed and they are applying for self sponsored cat category that probability of uh, admission is higher that is more so if you are doing job somewhere then you must provide the no objection certificate from the employer so that normally helps this is what i wanted to tell you before you apply the application make sure if you are doing the job you provide this you can even tell that you are not doing any job anywhere and apply but having no objection certificate from the employer is really helpful because in the interview uh, you get the advantage of that so who are employed and wish to do mtech on self finance basis uh, full time this is what you are to provide so if you go on uh, site of uh, you know uh, nit warangal Uh, let me open up i believe you are in position to see this this is the site of uh, nit warangal so if you go on this site here you will find announcements may mtech self finance admission brochure and instruction you can go there and you can find this particular information that means without gate students 
also are going to have opportunities in uh, uh, NITs and we'll keep on sharing those opportunities. And more important is the trick how you can convert it. So those of you who are in the job have a, a no objection certificate, they try to arrange the no objection certificate. Last year, as per my knowledge, uh, those students who were working somewhere in the industries and applied for self-sponsored category uh, got into these particular courses. That is a prestigious courses. So uh, uh, I hope uh, this uh, thing helps you and uh, we will have multiple options in and it is also you need to prepare for interviews and written exam. And uh, that is how if you clear it, you know, obviously these are the good courses to pursue forward. So uh, we'll keep on sharing more information about NITs. At least uh, five to 10 NITs, good NITs uh, will come out with the self-finance and we will soon discuss uh, with you those opportunities. So keep watching your PDF for all the details. Thank you.